Okay, one more time for the girlies who don't get it. Wealth does not create abundance. Abundance creates wealth. That means I cannot will myself, force myself, hustle my way to enough dollars that will make me feel abundant. This is because of the law of cause and effect. What is in the cause is already in the effect. Let that sink in for a moment. That means that if I'm not feeling abundant, I'm feeling scarce, and I chase wealth outside of me in order to create abundance, that's not possible because what was in the cause, which was scarcity, will be in the effect. Anything created from scarcity will continue to feel like scarcity. For example, if I feel poor and I want to make money in order to feel not poor, getting money will only feel like the same anxiety with a different outfit on. Now I'll just feel afraid that I'm going to lose all the money. I may even get to a certain income level and still want more money. This happens to people all the time. So if more money is not going to solve the problem, then what do we do? We dissolve the blocks and beliefs to experiencing abundance now. What is actually stopping me from believing that I am fully safe, fully capable, fully loved, fully free, fully creative now? That's obviously not very easy and you generally need guidance. But once I do that work and my desire is no longer to attain abundance because I have tapped into abundance, now I can create and attract without control, with detachment, with playfulness. And because wealth is abundance expressed, the more I can tap into this creative playfulness, this detachment, the more wealth I'm going to experience. Why? Because I'm healing my perfectionism. I'm healing my fear. I'm healing my anxiety. Nothing outside of me needs to happen anymore in order to secure myself. Everything I create is an extension and experience of myself. Everything should at this point be service-led, heart-led. And when you really think about it, the most amount of sales happen when I solve a problem and or make someone feel different.